In your opinion, what makes a man's man? Um, well, definitely, doesn't matter what the situation, what's happened, you never flush twice. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> you do what you've got to do, you flush once, and then you walk away. <laughs> No regrets, <laughs> no looking back, no trying to sort out the situation. <laughs> That's what a man's man does. <laughs> yeah. Do you think uh, John Wayne was ever going, oh, oh, I was still a bit pro. No. <laughs> There's a lot of. James Bond? No, oh, God, no. no. Let's go. Oh, God. Oh, I'll have to wait until the system feels up. <laughs> no! <laughs> He's out there! <laughs> <laughs> Fighting crime, not worrying about something floating around a pan. <laughs> Bob has admitted, and this is absolutely true, that when he first toured with Vic Reeves, he'd urinate in hotel room kettles because he couldn't be bothered to go to the toilet. <laughs> I'm not even going to ask about the chocolate on the pillow. <laughs> that, that's true, is it? Oh, I don't know, Jimmy. It's a long time ago. I did something that I shouldn't have done. And that feeling stays with me. <laughs> Did you piss in a kettle? Uh, yeah, and a number of kettles. <laughs> Fun fact, Miles can only... <laughs> Is this actually a fact, Jimmy? Yes, it is that? a fact. Okay. It's actually two facts, right. Miles. Thank you. Yeah, no, looking forward to it. Miles can only get an erection during a fox hunt. <laughs> <laughs> and ejaculates Waitrose elderflower cordial. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they were facts. <laughs> okay, the target was three four six. How did you do? Sean? Got it. Bob? Three four five. Richard? Uh three four six. Okay, perfect. And John? No, no, I didn't get that one. What, what? <laughs> What happened during that game? You you seemed distracted. I had uh, a little. I dealt with it. Just a little problem. <laughs> That's a shocking colour. You're dehydrated. <laughs> I think so. Stinks as well. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. What do you think? It doesn't smell good. It smells very. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, you need to see somebody. Bob. <laughs> Bob, have a little. Just have a little taste of that. You're all right, I prefer solids. <laughs> have you got a mascot? Yes, I have. Hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? He's <laughs> undressing. Oh, <geez. laughs> oh, Jesus. Wow. Uh, Sorry. God. <laughs> Have me lucky pants with me. <laughs> Doesn't look like you've had a lot of luck in them, to be honest. With you. <laughs> well, they've, they've brought me a lot of luck in the past. <laughs> Jack, <laughs> <fancy. laughs> imagine the state of your trousers if you haven't been wearing them. Shall I try them on? Oh look! Oh, oh don't yeah. put them on your trousers. All them all dirtied up. <laughs> It's sort of Superman's granddad. <laughs> I co committed to it and they're slightly oh, damp. I'd say my greatest achievement is probably getting married. Since, you know, I think it's easy to make someone like you. That's why people have affairs, isn't it? Easy to look attractive once a fortnight in a hotel. <laughs> Are you having an affair, John? Because <laughs> that was a very specific notion of how affairs might work. And also, if you were to have an affair, I would imagine it would be quite tightly scheduled. <laughs> well, you've got to have a schedule if you're having an affair. You can't Is it just... schedule or schedule? Oh. You said, he said schedule. You what let did it I go? say? Schedule? You said schedule. Is schedule right? I don't know. I don't give a sh just having an affair willy-nilly, can you? You can't just say, oh, I'll, I'll maybe pop round and do you in a bit. <laughs> or I'll 
do you at the greengrocers. You have to book a room. By the way, do you? <laughs> don't, don't, do, don't do those words. Do one. <laughs> do it. Do it. It. I'll pop over and we'll do it in a bit. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest, I've married one person. There's not going to be another one going to let me... <laughs> you know. Is there? Yeah. I wouldn't have thought so, no. I mean, my wife hasn't yet, but I'm told... <laughs> that any, any day I'm now. a very good boy. <laughs> Why have you got a life-size penis on the top of your head? Lads, 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 lads. <laughs> John, don't move a muscle, but the pen... <laughs> at these things. <laughs> okay, so, anyway. <laughs> Can I borrow your pen? Oh, no. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> I'm, actually, I'm very happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> Susie, I can only apologise. I realise you're one of the leading lexicographers in the country. Tell us something surprising about yourself. I, oh, yeah, I have a normal amount of pubic hair. <laughs> <laughs> really? Um, I was picturing yeah. more like a pistachio in a, in a hedge. Yeah, <laughs> people think I have loads, but they could be further from the truth. The amount I have is spot on. <laughs> the only thing is, though, it's not curly. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's straight and blonde. <laughs> so it hangs down in front of my pipe like a cream shower curtain. Exercise things you can do around the house whilst eating and going about your daily life. So I, have, I now have my knife and fork attached to two dumbbells. Oh. So you, you've got to really be pounding to... <laughs> My best one is for, for squat thrusts. What I do there is I've got one of those lavatory seats that lowers gradually, so I start pissing and I just knock it down. And then I've got to <laughs> just lower with the... Ju oh, still going! Oh. Well, that must be a disaster when you're out of your house with your fancy lowering very slowly toilet seat. It's just a regular one and you get yourself in the dick. That's... <laughs> Are you going to eat all of that? Yeah. <laughs> well... I'm... Oh, is it nice beef? Gonna give us excellent beef, yeah. When do you next plan on having a sh? <laughs> <laughs> not, not while he's eating his beef. <laughs> oh, sorry. You know, this might be the only thing you see me eat today, and yet immediately you think the first mouthful goes to you go, oh, how long does it take to have a sh? I mean, what? <laughs> have you got quite a, an efficient system? <laughs> oh, sometimes I have sh before I've even eaten it. <laughs> sometimes I have one in the morning, and I think, well, I haven't eaten anything, so. That must be the Weetabix I'm about to have. The greatest achievement must be rectum of the year. <laughs> not, not rear of the year, no. No, it's different, yeah. This is rear of the year with the gloves off. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I'd won when I, uh, I heard three of the judges <laughs> throwing up behind me. <laughs> I thought, I've got, I've got this in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> sure. A beef, sure. beef fern cotton. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hers. Let me tell you, hers is pretty messed up. <laughs> Stop speaking. And then, uh, of course, that got, <laughs> that got me through to the world. So I got to the, went to the world finals in Cancun. Cancun. I, I thought I was going to win. I thought I'm going to win this. Stop it. And then Diego Maradona beat me. <laughs> When he bent over, set the sprinklers off. <laughs> Hello there. What makes you happy? I like watching people pick up dog shit. <laughs> we always focus on the people who don't do it, but the, major the majority of people pick up dog shit. I think that's remarkable. With dogs. Majority who have people. dogs? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't have a dog, but I pick it up every now and again. <laughs> I'd like to know what it feels like. The little runny ones that people don't go for. I go for, like, <laughs> top level. I think even the pros haven't gone for that one, but I'll have a go. Do you think there are too small to pick up? 
I don't, as a fan. Uh... <laughs> Quite a slice of heaven you've carved out for yourself. Yeah. <laughs> What's odd, though, is there's the size of animal that you don't have to pick it up anymore. Like, horses can sh everywhere, and you can just leave that. So there must be a point at which, like, Great Dane or Shetland Pony, <laughs> in between, where people can just, as a bystander, say, fair play, that's too much. <laughs> I feel like this is a conversation happening on the internet. <laughs> We've got Lee and Dean uh, on the show tonight. Mm. Uh, are there any interesting uh, words or phrases that builders use? Well, for book 14, Jimmy, um, I did. I looked at the language of different professions and I had spent a day with about five builders, which was fun. <laughs> five was fun. of them? <laughs> um, and some plasters too. And we... <laughs> <laughs> you don't help yourself, do you? 